Hey, what's up guys? In this video, I will be showing you how to jailbreak the iPod Touch 3rd generation with the new Black Rain RC2. Uh, Black Rain, if you didn't know, is a jailbreak for both Windows and Mac by GeoHot. If this jailbreak works for you, I suggest that you go and donate to them. Even if it's just a dollar, there's a link in the sidebar. Um, and so just go ahead and check that out. So anyways, the jailbreak is very, very simple. But as some of you know, there are still people who still want to be sure how to do it or they're not maybe completely sure how to do it um, here I have an iPod Touch 3rd generation um, I guess the only way to prove it is obviously through voice control it can come on the other iPods um, so for this jailbreak it is tethered and what does tether mean? it means that if you should have to turn off or need to reboot your iPod, you need to be by a computer and run this black brain jailbreak to boot it up again. Now this only applies to the iPod Touch third generation and the new 3GS is with the new boot ROM. So to do this jailbreak, simply go ahead and download black rain. There's a link in the sidebar. It's very simple. Blackrain.com. You're gonna have to go scroll down and then you're either going to select Windows or Mac now I have Windows so you can go ahead and do Windows save file go ahead and save it to the desktop and you can see downloading once you're done downloading what you're going to want to do is go ahead and take your iPod Touch 3rd generation and uh, I already have this one jailbroken but it's the same simple process you're just going to go ahead and plug it in it's going to be plugged in and turned on and uh, obviously sync and process whatever I'll just go ahead and slightly cancel that so to show you basically how it works I'm just going to go ahead and turn it off So this is pretty much the jailbreak right here. Um, there's Black Rain. Now for this jailbreak, what I would suggest to do is uh, go ahead and on your go ahead and go on your desktop. <coughs> go to Black Rain. Right click. Run as administrator. Go ahead and hit yes. It'll obviously dif be different if you're on a Mac. And there it is right there. This is the jailbreak. Go ahead and click Make It Rain. It'll say Waiting for Device. It'll say Running. Then it'll go and say that the iPod is in uh, recovery mode in iTunes. And it will say your jailbreak is done. Once your device reboots for tethered, run again. Like I said, you need to run this again to reboot. And there it says done, wait for reboot. And then you will have GeoHot on your uh, iPod. And don't worry, this does not, like, this is not your new, uh, your new, uh, custom boot logo, if that's what you want to say. So then slide to unlock to go to Black Rain. And the application will be on your string board, like you see in the pictures in front of you. What you're going to want to do is go into the Black Rain application and make sure you're connected to Wi-Fi or if you're using this tutorial for a 3G or 3GS or uh, iPhone 2G, just make sure you're connected to the internet somehow. <coughs> install whatever you want. You can install the Rockstore, IC, or Cydia. I suggest only installing IC as RipDev is no longer in the iPhone community. so. There will be like no more updates for IC unless someone takes up the project. So let's say you're you know you're messing with your iPod and it simply dies or turns off. Pretty simple. So I'll just go ahead and like say I have to reboot or something. So there it is. It's turned off. And what you're just gonna go do is go run as administrator. Yes, if you need to. 
and go ahead and just click make it rain again and then it will successfully boot up like so and then you still have all your applications and all your settings are still there that way you're not restarting so it is a tethered jailbreak but it is pretty much better than having no jailbreak on your iPod touch than nothing you know so now for some FAQs or seem to be FAQs uh, one, will this work on the iPod Touch first or second generation? Yes. The first generation was like the block one, um, like the picture in front of you. And then the second generation looks exactly like this, but the only thing it does not have the only thing it does not have is voice control. And obviously, as if you have a 3G, you know that you can't use voice control without the headphones being plugged in. Number two, does Black Rain jailbreak with, with all iDevices? Yes, it does. So this means it works with the iPhones, um, 2G, 3G, 3GS, as well as the iPod Touch. Um, number three, my device keeps on rebooting endlessly and like won't stop. Simply hold down the home button and connect to your computer. Keep holding the home button though as you connect in this. There's a link to annotation right in front of you. Click that and it will show you how to uh, get into recovery mode. And then you can just restart this all over. And four, this didn't work for me. Um, all you have to do is try again. Black Rain RC2 was made to work with all devices with no problems. Now what I mean by no problems is that they connect and jailbreak successfully. Now I know you're like successfully, you know, tethered, whatever. They're still working on that. Um, but, you know, they need more work, better tethered than no jailbreak at all. So, any more uh, questions, leave your questions in the comment section below. As always, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe for more videos. And also, don't forget to follow me on uh, Twitter. Uh, Twitter.com backslash irockish, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.